James Cameron talks to reporters after his successful dive to the deepest part of the ocean. The deep, which is only a small part of the Mariana Trench, is something like 50 times the size of the Grand Canyon. So, you know, this is a vast, you know, uh, uh, frontier down there that's going to take us a while to understand. The whole sub actually squeezes down uh, almost three inches in length uh, when it gets to the bottom of the ocean just because of the pressure. And the sphere that I'm in actually actually shrinks. The, the window that I look out actually pushes in toward me under 16,000 pounds per square inch of pressure. It was very lunar, a uh, very desolate place, very, uh, very isolated. Uh, my, my feeling was one of complete isolation from all of humanity. I mean, I felt like I literally in the space of one day have gone to another planet and come back. Many of the animals that live there are adapted to this extreme pressure, this total darkness. They're usually white, they have no pigment, some of them have eyes to see uh, bioluminescence, some of them have no eyes at all. Uh, it's, com it's a completely alien world. The dive follows seven years of planning and the design and construction of a specialized submarine that allowed Cameron to withstand the immense pressure of the ocean floor. Cameron is the first person to make a solo dive to the spot. He spent about three hours on the bottom collecting research samples while documenting the trip with photographs and video footage. Sally Turner for IB Times TV.